do? to let's see check everything before we continue yeah we're just gonna go right into the stream because of uh yeah sick of this shit. Really, really, really. It's like every day this week. Every god dang day this week that I've streamed has been a storm. This, this place looks like looks bad. It looks like a TV is still on. Maybe I should check it out. Yeah, sure. Check it out there, buddy. Hmm, VCR. VCR? What the hell? I don't remember this. And a set of videotapes. Let's see what's on them. Tape one, the original crisis. Yes, camera's ready. Then if all not, please tell us about the Cetra. Two thousand years ago, our ancestors, the Cetra, heard the cries of the planet. The first one to discover the planet wound, the planet's wound were the Cetra and the the nose pole. I don't remember. That. Hey, Ping. Yeah, sorry it's late. I literally just uh, hit the button, started the stream. And the fucking storm cut the power for like a minute. Our leader, squirrel leader, I just now noticed. <laughs> That's fine. But yeah, the power had to cut out, so I sat there for literally ten minutes waiting to see if the power was going to flicker or if, the, or if the internet was going to get messed up. So, everything seems to be good, but just uh, the storm is mostly passed, I guess. Second day this week, a storm has interrupted my damn stream. I swear, Mother, Mother Nature must be really pissed at me. Alright. Tell us, Afonda, where is the nose pole? It's up my ass, apparently, the way this week's going. Nose pole refers to this area. The Cetra then began a planet reading. Afonda, what exactly does planet reading entail? I can't explain it very well, but it's like having a conversation with the planet. It said something fell from the sky, making a large wound. Thousands of Cetra pulled together, trying to heal the planet, but due to the severity of the wound, it was only able to heal itself over many years. Do the ancestors rather than Cetra have special powers to heal the planet? No, it's not that kind of power. The life force of all living things on this planet becomes the energy. The Cetra tried to desperately cultivate the land so as not to diminish the needed energy. Hmm, even here, so close to the North Cave, the snow never melts. Is that because the planet's energy is gathered here to heal its injury? Yes, the energy that was needed to heal the planet withered away the land. And then the pla planet. The planet tried to persuade the Cetra to leave the Nose Pole, but when the Cetra prepared to part with the land they loved, that's when it appeared. It looks like our dead mothers and our dead brothers showing us specters of their past. Who is the person that appeared at the North Cave? I haven't ha had I have any idea. That's when the one who injured the planet, or the crisis from a from the sky, as we call him, came. He first approached as a friend, deceived them, and finally gave them the virus. The Cetra were attacked by the virus and went mad, transforming into monsters. Then, just to see it at to see ha ah, ah, damn. Thank you, Ping, and thank you... Thank you, Cade, for subscribing for 12 months. Let me just click that button. Very nice. It's a whole year! I should have sound effects, but I don't, so... Maybe I should get on that at some point. He approached the other eccentric kinds, infecting him with the virus. You don't look well. Let's call it a day. Tape 2. What is weapon? If all that, can you ca comment on the thing called weapon? 
Yes, Professor. The one the Professor mistook for a Cetra was named Genova. That is the crisis from the sky. The planet knew it had to destroy the crisis from the sky. You see, as long as Genova exists, the planet will never be able to fully heal itself. Oh, big yells at cloud fan art coming. It felt God. I, I, have, I, I have never received... Actually, no, I take it back. I have received one bit of fan art in, in my, my, my whole thing as a streamer and a YouTuber. Uh, I, I forgot who sent it. I still have it. They sent it through you know, the internet and everything, so I still have it somewhere, but yeah. <laughs> Back then, weapon was a weapon that the planet produced of its own will? Yes, but there is no record of weapon ever being used. A small number of the surviving Cetra defeated Genova and confined it. The planet produced weapon, but it was no longer necessary to use it. To this day, weapon remains asleep somewhere in the planet. Even though Genova is confined, it can come back to life at some time. The planet was not fully healed itself yet. It is still watching Genova. Where is Weapon? Show your victory over Terminator. <laughs> I don't know. I can't hear the voice of the planet well. Times have changed. The planet is probably watching the situation closely. Yes, watch the situation. If you don't get that thing out of me, I don't like it. Thank you, Afon. That will be all for today. Day three, daughter's record, death day after birth. What do you mean, Professor? I mean, honey. Ooh, okay, so the professor ended up marrying his test, his, 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 his research subject. Well, I'm thinking of taping on video, but the video's not working right. What are you going to tape? Is there still something I haven't mentioned? No, that's not it. I'm going to record my beautiful daughter. And then when she's sleeping, her face looks like an angel. First, we have to figure out her name. We can take the video later. I've already decided. Her name will be Aerith. Even though this game can't ever decide between Aerith or Earth. Ooh, it's Rasputin or the Traveler from D2. The planet is watching. Or the Traveler. The planet is watching. Let's see. T take your pick. You either have an asshole freaking robot that likes shooting things, or you have a freaking ball in the sky that's falling apart. Either one's lovely. Uh, apparently Gas is recording his daughter sleeping. I know, it's creepy. Where's... That's that. You are so selfish, but Aerith is a good name. <laughs> it's a good name considering it came out of that forgotful head of yours. Right? Oh, the videotape. Tape 4. Dawes record, 20th day after birth. Video again? You just got through taping. Please don't say that that way. It's our lovely daughter, both yours and mine. Don't you want to capture her childhood on videotape? If you keep doting her like that, she won't grow up to be strong. Aerith is different from the other children. I wonder what dangers away here. Many dangers. Many, many. And I am, I'm not him, it's the other guy, not me. Never say that. I'll protect you and Aerith no matter what. You and Aerith are my only treasures. I'll never let you go. I feel so much better now, darling. If I hadn't met you, I... Knock, knock. Oh, here it goes. Who could that... I was just about to... Dang! How dare they intrude on our private time together. I'll send them away. Y yes, at once. Who, the devil? It it's him! <laughs> I've been searching for you, Fauna. Or should I say, Cetra? Long time no see, Professor Gast. Oh, Joe, how'd you know? Believe me, I had to turn over a stone or two to find you. Two years I waited. That's how much I wanted this new sample. <laughs> new sample? You don't mean Aerith. Hey, Aerith? What a nice name. <laughs> That's it, I'm serving all types of the Shinra, Hojo. Please leave. Please, Aerith has nothing to do with it. All you want is me, right? A Fauna! I'll eat all of you from my experiment. You understand, don't you, Professor Gath? We can change the future of the planet! Don't worry, Afon, I'll take care of this. Please don't put up a fight. I don't want any harm to come to my precious sample. <laughs> what a funny looking camera. God, destroy it! Videos cut out, but sound can still be heard. That's not a blender, that's a test tube! That's a test tube! Is it supposed to be a test tube that uh, someone made? Be careful with her. <laughs> what are you doing, Professor? If only, take your earth and run. Bang. Ah, darling. Oh, and don't forget the chop. Hmm, a video? The ancient slip. <laughs> I'm mounting the treasure. Thank you, Professor. <laughs> Hojo is a dick. Hojo always and forever will be a dick. Let's save. 
Yeah, it's just a picture. It's not, uh... Anything. Okay, what's going on here? I'm just an old man. I don't need to be friendly. No, no, sit down, Great Pepsi. It's dangerous. Please don't go. I'm still going. Damn, I'll just be nice. What the? Who are those people over there? Looks like trouble. There they are. Hurry. Yes, ma'am. Uh, might wanna. <laughs> you won't. I won't let you go any further. What's down there? It's a secret. It really doesn't matter. Both of you really got guts doing my boss like that. What the hell? Radio! Cthulhu Mythos RPG. I just got sent us a gift right in the little stream. Thanks, for you. I'm sitting there, yes, schmuck. Head back over. You mean boss Singh? That wasn't us. Sephiroth did it. No, don't think you can fool me, liar. I'm not lying. It was Sephiroth. Don't try to act this. I'll never forget it. Oh, man. It's like talking normal cut. You're going to feel some pain. No, I can handle him. There's no way he... There's no way he can avoid my punch. Elena, you're, you're gonna fail. Uh, uh oh, yeah. Okay. Take this. Fling! Down she goes, Neil! <laughs> Elena! Yeah, you go down too, dummy. You'll go so bored in the match. If you go down that way, it'll lead you to death. Can't let you go, Casey. Okay, so, wait, wait, okay. Okay, let me see. Um. Can I use the thing now? I, yeah, I, I need the snowboard in the map. How would you let me have the snowboard in the map? I need to leave, you dumbass. Okay, uh, I need to, uh... Maybe I just try to leave. Nope. Okay. That didn't go... Okay, I need to find someone here. Let me... Can I borrow your snowboard? Switch the northern that I'm at. You're hiking. Go. Better take that map on the wall. Okay. Okay, so take the... Got the map. We're hurt right about the time we moved here. I never should have bought my snowboard. Okay, that mean I can have it? Let me talk to the kid. Hey, kid, can I borrow your snowboard? I can hear my snowboard. Now I can't go on here for a while. Hey, I'll give you my snowboard. Tell me you get good at it. My cowboy and astronaut dolls are so lifelike. Your cowboy and astronaut dolls? Mm -hmm. Wait, how many ethers do I have? 24. That should be enough. It's important. Don't lose it. Okay. Uh, I guess we're still in one piece. Okay, so I don't even get to do the sled and it just throws me right here. Everyone alright? Yeah, somehow. I can't be doing this! Damn! So we hand. Looks like we jumped pretty far. Sure it's cold. We'll freeze if we don't stay here any longer. Probably means go up, 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 up. Okay, that's good that you missed. Thank you, Cloud and your enormous sword. Uh -huh. Oh, and there's a Ryu. Yes, there's a me. It's a me, uh, a Ryu! I didn't know I didn't know it was a Pokemon, but alright then. Well, don't talk about Pokemon right now. Oh god. Why not? What's wrong with me saying anything about Pokemon? <laughs> um because uh, uh, Nintendo just announced a Pokemon MOBA for mobile. 
<sighs> Sorry about that. Mm. Sounds like you're tired. It's been a long week, and I still got tomorrow left. But it's been long. But I'll be alright. It sounds more like you don't want to do tomorrow. <laughs> I kind of don't, but if I have to, then I will. Yeah, that sounds real. Uh, I'll do it if I have to, even though I don't want to go. I don't want to go. I don't want to <laughs> look at them people. I want, especially my dumbass boss who can't spell for shit. I want to see him. No way. Because that's what I'm hearing from you right now. you just like, no, I don't want to go work. No, fuck them people. <laughs> well, I think Barrett's going to die here. Oh, no, he's still alive somehow. Okay, that's surprising. I'm sure his ass would have died, but okay. So, other than that, how was your day? Busy as usual. How about your orders, good sir? I'm about to bitch slap Mother Earth, I swear to God, but Mother Nature, because it did it again. I started streaming, everything went out. But you're still here. Well, no, I had to come back. I, wait, I waited a good, like, ten minutes for everything to set back up. So it took me 20 minutes to set back up. Ah. Sword and Shield there's, Drama DLC and you There's another storm. storm in your area? Yep, right over my house again! <laughs> it was clear skies up until I said, hmm, let me, let me start my stream. Then the storm rolled in, I'm like, you motherfucking serious now. You mean Mother Nature hates, hates you streaming now? I swear, I swear, it seems like it. I swear. It happens again. I'm gonna, I'm gonna build a ladder, and I'm gonna bitch slap Mother Nature right in the face. Like, bitch, stop that! Or what? Slap! <laughs> Watch it, or I'll shit on your curtains, too. Oh, dear. I ain't got no patience, I swear. Ain't got no patience for, for this stupidity. <sighs> now Cloud about to die. Like, Cloud, don't quit, 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 quit being about to die, because that's irritating me. Stop it. Sarah Kirkie's with shit, so she said, hold my beer. Yeah, and I spit in her beer, too. Really? Your ass still motherfucking alive? <sighs> SHUT UP! <laughs> Freaking storm, I swear to God. It's like, it's just, it's just the timing. It's just, shh. Okay, fuck you too, you freaking sea slug looking bitch. Freaking kill Barrett one hit like that with your bullshit. Punk ass, bitch ass, motherfucking son of a bitch. I ain't got no patience no more. All my patience done left me. All my patience done up and left. Just said, nope, bye. So you sound like you had a day today, so share. Well, no, I, I, I did. Well, I still can't get on Ark because for some reason Ark that the server won't show up for me, so I'm kind of butt fucked there. I haven't been able to get on for the past like two weeks, so I'm pretty sure all my animals have probably starved to death. Mm -hmm. If you kill Barrett again, so help me, sweet Jesus! Oh, you can go die in the fire, you freaking slug. And then we go. Okay, what are we gonna do for dinner? Uh, well, we'll just eat what we have in house, my grandma. I want to go to Long John Silver's. Like son of a bitch. <laughs> I was, I was, I was, I was so good relaxing in the house because it's hot as hell outside. It's literally a hundred and something around here. Yeah, of course, Florida weather. And she's like, I want Long John Silver's, and I'm like, 
I don't want to go nowhere. Oh, could you stop here and get me my magazine? It's like, no, I don't want to stop it. Mother... Shoves the $60 in my hand. Go get it. Like, son of a bitch! <laughs> so, out we go to go get her freaking Long John Silvers and her books. And I'm like, why, 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 why can't we just have a nice... Why can't we... Okay. One day where I don't have to go through a one god dang day. Kidding me with this bullshit? Are you really kidding? Me? Oh, your magic misses on these guys. I swear to Jeebus. Whoever thought that was a good idea needs to be kicked dead square in the penis with a pair of cleats. And of course, it's all the crap going on with my state, how they're going. Okay, we decided we're not going to do the mandatory mask ordinance because some people might not like that. And I'm like, you know, how about the some people who don't like it deal with it? Yes. I gotta wear a mask because I got people at my house who are asymptomatic. Who, if they get it, they will die. I don't care. I won't wear a mask. Come here, old man. I'm gonna crack you in the face. Yeah, well, I told somebody this before. A lot of people out there don't give a flying fucks. Yeah, and that's the problem. Like, I don't care about nothing. Yeah, well, here, you know here, I'm gonna take your, 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 I'm gonna take this chair and I'm gonna put it across your face. <laughs> Cause since you don't care, I guess you won't mind if I crack your skull in. You know, the funny thing about the, about the whole pandemic thing, somebody probably bust out laughing when I say this, or probably not, because it's sad, and it's sad, and I don't know what hit there, somebody said this, but, um, person gets up and goes, now they get up and go, good night. Now, what, now, what were his words talking about? I don't need a mask because it impedes my freedoms, or some crap like that. I'm not wearing a mask because it impedes my ability to be me. Well, well, well you know what? No one cares about your being you because you're a piece of shit anyway. <laughs> U.S. COVID, England, U.S. COVID, England is a rising whale. Yep. Give him some. Yeah, I will give him some chin music, uh, Charles. Yeah, I have seen. But yeah, I have seen the. Uh, He's on the witch. The many, many TV channels of your state, big. Oh, I've seen many, many channels about your state right now. Aren't they all great? Oh, yes. Yes, they are. Yes. It's just great for live TV. All you need now is popcorn and a soda. Yeah, that's it's 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 yeah. Yes, yeah. it's 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 like a, it's it's like I saw the video of the old man shoving his way into a Walmart because he didn't want to wear a mask. I'd have been hold up, no, no, don't put hands on. I'll solve this for you. Crack. There. Now you don't have to worry about nothing. <laughs> Take him to the hospital. Ain't get no fa ain't get no facials anyway. Ah, it, it's just it's just so irritating because. And by being all freaking selfish and shit, like, I, don't, I ain't doing shit. What the f... Yeah. It's messed up how the world is right now, but... And it's, it's only gonna, gonna get worse. Yes, unless people will actually get together and do something about it instead of doing what they do now. But they don't. Or they're not, because people are going to complain one way or the other. Yep. Yep, I'm sure there's probably right now a whole bunch of people out there at Walmarts right now buying fireworks just to shoot fireworks off. 
I'm going to shoot some fireworks off, and I'm going to hold a mortar in my hand and blow my hand off while I do it. Yeah! And I'm just sitting back there with a rifle going, if the fireworks don't do it, I know I will. <laughs> Oh lord. Oh, I s no. yeah, the man running around with the freaking freaking claw in his hand like he was Wolverine. No. no, I can see you. You know, you, no, if everybody remembers the NES theme got from Gotcha, that'll be big. It's like here. Da 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 Be very, very quiet. I'm going to hunt morons. Yes! <laughs> yes, most indubitably, I will. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna be like freaking Elmer Fudd with this. I'm gonna be like Elmer Fudd when he fought Batman! And he gave Batman run for his goddamn money! He made Batman sweat for that win. Mmm. Oh my god, okay, this, 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 this is irritating game. This, this really is. Yeah, it's just insane world. It's, it's bizarro world right now, and it just makes me just wanna... It's bizarre. Cloud, could you just kill it's her, just please? people don't believe what they say on TV, so... All I did, all, all I could do now was just keep myself safe. That's about it. Because, like I said before, people are going to do what they feel like, complaining mm -hmm. about it. You're sitting down here and going, you shouldn't do this, and complaining about it now, so I ain't going to change that. Thank you! God uh, bless you, sir. Thank you. <laughs> Why would Phil Aaron Hunter right now let me in? <laughs> well, we're in the thing, man. I don't know why you ain't gonna come in. Well, I see why I feel like Aaron Hunter right now. You know, let me in. <laughs> Not in the voice chat. Okay, come on. Where? Which way you was? Oh my god. Why? Oh, yeah, this place before you drop down dead. We dropped down from freezing. Except, except, uh, that doesn't seem to be happening. Huh. <laughs> so instead, they just turn it into a horrible freaking maze. Where is that walk to? Hey, it was a horrible freaking maze in the original game. Yeah, but it was climbing, so you knew your direction was always going to be up somehow. In this game, it's like, nah, we ain't gonna tell you shit. That boy is. What are you talking about? We're in the. Check your servers. We're in the streaming server, buddy. Okay, where's my walkthrough? Okay, where is it? No. Please tell me where the hell am I freaking going? Are you telling me that's all that bullshit did? That you. Ah, you're over here. Yes! <laughs> it took me a while to find you. I was like, Jesus. You over like, there? Yeah, I felt like Eric Andre. I'm like, let me in! Okay, you're in. No, no, I'm in. No, I'm in. I don't feel good. Yes, and now you probably want to get out. <laughs> Never. <laughs> I'm just going to go deeper. You can only go so far, my friend. That just sounds so wrong. <laughs> that, that's why I said it. <laughs> we're going deep. It's like, we're going deeper! Uh... Yeah. Uh -huh. bite, bite that pillow. We're going in dry. Oh no! Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's been it's been a few months. I solved all I resolved all my lawsuits. Fuck you, Debbie! Mm. 
So, yeah, oh dude, what is with your state? Jesus. How the fuck am I supposed to know? You think I'm king of Florida? Like I control Jesus. this shit? If I controlled this shit, they would be a lot quieter. I'd be walking around with a baseball bat. Shut your ass up! <laughs> dude, I'm just like, wow. Somebody, you know what? Somebody honestly needs to take a camera and just walk around and start filming that shit and put it on, like, a reality TV show. Just start your own, just like, you know, just stupid shit or just call it stupid people. It, you, you'd make a killing. They do have stupid people. All you have to do is watch TV and, and look at how many people are on the beach. There you go. Congratulations. Yeah, no, but I what I'm saying. All Sammy would have to do is just record that footage and just, like, make <laughs> his own show. Boom, that's it. You'd be instantly retired right there, Sammy. <laughs> sell that, sell that shit to Spotify like Joe Rogan, and you're out. These are the, these are the people I'm gonna strangle. This person right here. <laughs> yeah. This person right here. Oh yes, definitely this person right here. Okay, then, I found then, a house. You know, what you, you know, you shit? do. Then you slow mo it, and you like, you you put that just like that. There's no like sound. Just slow mo it and go like black and white video, and oh, go God. at this moment. This tard knew he done fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh, I'm yeah, awake. That's yeah. a great glacier. It's a miracle, all right. My name is Hope. How did I just pass out? I just went. This fucking game. Yeah, I've done that too when I did. When I played on the PS1 version. Don't even. Yeah, worry. yeah, but there was a thing to tell you. You passed out. I just go up a room and suddenly, poof, you're here. What the fuck? Uh, no, 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 no. No, magically in the PS1 version, I went from the Great Glacier to the guy's house. Yeah, going, but there was there was a cutscene that you passed out. It's like, oh, you passed out. This one, no, I just could transition. Thing, when I played the game on PS1, I did not pass out. Strangely enough, I got all the way from the Great Glacier to the guy's house. Well, aren't, well, I, well, I guess in this game, they're just taking the middle man out. No, we're not going to give you the chance to make it down, y'all. We're just going to make you pass out. And the funny thing about it, though, is I have no idea how I, how I did either, because I was trying to find the see, the see. woman in the cave, and next thing I know, here I am. Listen, see, if that happens to you, Sammy, you know what that, you know what that means? You better call a lawyer, because somebody slipped you a date rape drug. Mm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I've been roofing! All sudden, yeah, all of a sudden you pass out, you wake up, how the fuck am I here? Mm -hmm. You better check that butthole. <laughs> You got all kinds of loving that you didn't want. Okay, for, okay. First of all, could not see that happen in the bed at any time soon. <laughs> you never know, man. That's not funny. Winter's winter's coming. Mm. Chick, chicks need chicks need to warm up. Yeah, but I don't want none of the ones around my area. That is also true. But if I know the chicks. If I know the chicks in Big's area, or probably the same chicks in my area, good old North Carolina, they'll probably look dead at Big, stare at him for a couple seconds, one of them probably bust out laughing, one of them will probably whisper to their friends and have no interest in, have no interest in with my friend here. Okay. It's all good. Just, just, just be like Billy, be like Billy the Fridge, tie a donut around your neck, they'll chase you. <laughs> Oh look, Rin died. Rin, guy is this. No, I gotta make sure it's Krispy Kreme. Ugh, not in this heat, man. It'd be sticky. That's the point. Not yeah. open. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, it, it, trust me. Just don't stick it around your neck. Stick it around another neck, if you know what I mean. I know exactly what you mean. Yeah. Uh, you nasty. If it gets sticky, all well, right, man. How many licks does it take? Oh God. <laughs> Just go, I don't know, but we gonna find out. <laughs> you, you're wrong, man. You, you, you just, that you're not right. That's, that's not, that's just wrong, man. Yes, I got a funny feeling you and Izzy would get along very well right now, yes. Just double the snark. No, but see, there, 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 there could be a, a difference here. See, like, I, I've, I've done all that, you know, I will, like, profess. To. Like if I if I'll be like oh yeah do this, been there done that. Hmm. Okay, 
tell me you just woke up randomly and wonder why you were here. Yes. Have I ever woken up? One yeah. Yeah, I do, I do have to admit that, yeah. That, that was one hell of a fucking party, I will say. <laughs> it's wake that's, up, what that, the that's, hell? That's, that's, yeah, that's no, you done been drinking too much. You wake up the next day and you're like, oh my god, why am I here? You check your butthole, did anyone do anything? Okay, I think we're good. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> okay, uh, I might be in trouble here. Why? Um, they're hitting for like four or five hundred. Yeah, you might be in trouble there. I'm gonna see if I can escape. Or I ha I can't run because running ain't gonna I ain't gonna survive or run. Escape. Escape. Oh yeah, oh, I have, let me see. Let me run! Nope! Death! Oh! oh I, no! Oh no, god, that's it. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to level grind now! In this fantastic area. <laughs> okay, what's down here? Maybe I can come down here. I miss old-fashioned 8-bit graphics. Sometimes! Yeah. Dude, on the Nintendo Switch, they, they decided to come up with this uh, Super Nintendo, Nintendo kind of emulator thing on it, anyhow. Mm -hmm. Dude, I'm telling you, man. I was never so pissed off at fucking Punch-Out in my life the other night. I almost smashed my Switch. Hey, you should have been here last stream when Big played a game when he had to learn how to block. Dude, like, oh my god. Yeah, it's not, it's not like you have to learn how to block at the right time. It's literally you have to earn the ability to block. To block. You have to earn the ability to block? Yes. yes. You have to earn the ability to block. Yo, you so you got block. you got to get punched in the face until you until your character goes, shit, that hurts. Maybe I should stop doing this. Yeah, it's, no. a, it's a freaking wolf. You're playing as a wolf who has a big sword. <laughs> that bitch should know automatically. Here, put sword in front of... Face. Oh look at that! I can block. No, you have to go through half a god dang level, find a little orb to, to learn orb. how to fucking just to block. Level, just to learn how to block. Jesus. Yes, I bust out laughing when I found that out too. Amongst all the three, somebody, was the only one who could beat it. Yeah, I'm the only one who beat it. And I have video evidence of it too. Jesus. What? Your character thinks he's Rocky or something? No, he's it's it, it, your character is a freaking furry, who a furry? Yes, unfortunately, yes. he's a wolf with a big sword. Oh, okay. And you have to go through these pain in the ass levels halfway really to get the ability. Too. Then you have to go back and leave the level, get another ability, so you can even finish that level. Imagine this. Imagine you get hit. You, you know, you get hit, and you fly back twenty feet. Oh yeah, you got them physics too. You get hit, you're like tissue paper. Whee! Oh, it, it pissed no, me off trying to play. I tried to, I tried to tell Big not to do it, but he started it, so I was like, ah! And never mind. That's, that's when you just sit back, have some popcorn, and enjoy the show. Dang, I enjoyed something, all right? That's all I'm in there right now. Oh, look at that. I can walk right back to the freaking good. Walk right back here. You could have just let me do this game. You could have just let me walk up to the place instead of with that freaking bullshit and the freaking icicle glacier bullshit. No, that would be that would be too easy. I don't give a shit. <laughs> and, and the and the game developer, that asshole who put that in, was probably giggling his ass off, going, "You know what? This is gonna piss some people off, but let's do it." Oh, you, you, you mean like The Last of Us? Yeah. Dude, uh, what is with this, like, I keep hearing about it and I haven't seen it, but what's this big deal about this, like, there's supposed to be, like, a sex scene in it or something like that? There's some, like, huge fucking scandal over it? <laughs> it's, I don't it's, know. It's, it just it's, looks like it's, two dudes going at it. I'm like, okay, it's, well... It's, um, well, in the beginning they said that was supposed to be a trans woman. Now they've come out and say, no, that's officially a woman. 
I'm so not, wait, a I'm, trans woman is getting it on with a dude. Originally, yeah, yeah, that's and then they said, "Oh shit, no, we're gonna back up and say, oh, it's a regular dude, a regular. It's, it's a regular woman who's just kind of stuff. Yep, who's just yeah. very, very, very muscular, butch looking, or rough looking, or whatever the hell it is. Yeah, whatever bullshit they want to. It's like it. okay, I have some. I know someone who's playing. He says the great, the gameplay is decent." Everything else, uh, is bad. There's, I just don't. I just don't know why game companies just don't have the balls to stick to you know original. It's plans. because you, the idiot who's running that particular company, is trying to appear woke. That's what he's doing. He's trying to appear what? Woke. You know, try, trying to go with the trends and say, oh, I am appealing to this particular brand of uh, shoppers. Well, my thing is, yo, if you're woke, as you know, one would say the term would be, then you would leave the transgendered stuff in there. If you're so woke and you're so of the people. I mean, Jesus Christ, Disney, for fuck's sakes, is, is apparently, uh, uh, what, working on uh, uh, their first transgendered princess. From what I hear. Disney. I mean, who? Oh, I, I don't know. I, I guess they're in development still, right? But it's transgender. Or... Yeah. Right. But they uh, what was it they did. Uh, there was a big, huge scandal over that. OK, there was no African-American ones. And then, boom, you got one. There was no, you know, quote unquote, uh, Eastern, you know, Asian or your typical what most people would classify as Asian. You get Mulan and Jasmine. It's just like, okay. Oh, Ping just said it. Disney removed that one gay kiss out of Star Wars for China. And it was like, it was in the yeah. background, so you barely even saw it. And it's yeah, like, but, let's just cut that, because Chinese don't yeah, like that. Yeah, but you know, you know they'll cut that shit out. Mm-hmm. But, um, what was it? Disney went as far... I don't know... Well, I don't know if Disney endorsed it, condoned it, or whatever, but I didn't hear them really kick up a kerfuffle. Um, there was a TV show that kind of uh, delved with the uh, the Disney characters, um, and the character in it uh, who, who played Mulan um, got an Asian American actress to to play her, um, but apparently she was lesbian. I didn't hear anything about that. Um, what the hell was that name? Was that show? It was big. It was, it was either on NBC or ABC. Had, um... Oh, uh, the... the what was the name of it? Oh, I can't remember. It was a big show, anyhow. But, yeah. There was no, uh... No kerfuffle over all that, so I'm like, okay. But I'm like, you got games like, what was it, Mafia 3, where apparently there's a homosexual uh, sex scene in it that your character can apparently fully watch. So I'm like, okay, so what's, what's the big deal? I mean, at the end of the day, if you don't want to buy the game because of that one scene, then okay, don't buy the game. Tough shit. No. What people are going to do is people are going to buy it, and then if they see the scene, they do what they usually do. They complain about it nonstop. It gets all over social media. Blah, 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 mm -hmm. blah. Dude, they just they just need to turn social media off. They, no, the problem is you have people who want to be upset at things for the sake of being upset at things. Upset, exactly. They just need to turn social media off. You basically said you should turn social media off. People don't know how to turn social media off. <laughs> They live and breathe social media. No, but I mean, it's... I mean, Jesus, like, we created, like, a whole society of, like, retards that, that don't know how to think for themselves. Pretty it's, much. It's just a... It's a herd mentality, and it's, like... This is the kind of same mentality that, like, fucking... Made, like, the Kardashians famous. It made, uh, like... How many... Like, who's that one fucking stupid YouTube guy that keeps getting into shit for the stupid shit he does. I um, have. There's, there's too many to count for that. Yeah, there's too oh, many he's, 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 doing, he's doing he's doing boxing now. 
No idea. Uh, he, got, he got in shit for apparently going to Japan and walking into the... Uh... Oh! Fucking Logan shitface Paul. Yeah, that's it. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, we create fucktards like that and put them on a platter and lift them up. And it's like, fuck, are you kidding me? Yes, how it is. Oh, uh, you know his brother got arrested for freaking uh, 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 helping the pr helping the freaking riots. Oh, dude, dude, I mean, what did the guy expect? He's sitting there running around with, you know, people rioting and they're filming it and they're just trying to say, oh, well, no, we, we weren't doing nothing. We were just there filming. I'm like, okay. Sure. We were there filming. Don't you fucking lie to me, Billy boy. I yeah. see you over there. You freaking took that bottle from that friend and said, oh, I got me a bottle of Hennessy. Yeah, that's yep. stolen, you freaking moron. Yep. That's and they had like, it's like, nothing. Listen, man, as far as I'm concerned, if you're there and you're doing nothing to stop the rioting and looting, like, there's one thing between, don't get me wrong, there's protesting, go ahead. By all means, protest the shit out of yourself. Go ahead. Fucking just protest until you can't protest no more. Go for it. But when you start turning it into fucking rioting and looting and fucking all that shit and destroying innocent people's businesses, you know what I mean? That's where it's like, okay, look, either you are, you are actively trying to stop it and prevent it, at least verbally, or you are contributing to it and you're an accessory after the fact. So for this this YouTube dude to go all up in that and be like, oh man, I was just filming, I you know taking a stroll filming, yeah, sure. How about <laughs> how, 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 how about we how about we you know show part of the video where where you know that you probably edited it out where you're like pocketing shit yourself. <sighs> and like, did he think his? His presence there would be a negative or a positive thing, because you can hear in the video they're like, "Yo, that's that 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 dude that was Logan Paul. That was him. He's there. Oh yeah, that's him." They're like, "Yo, Logan, what do you think's gonna happen? People are gonna be like, oh, well, shit. Let's do some stupid shit because Buddy's there. He's gonna put us on his channel." Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. This is why our future is doomed. Pretty We're much. not going to get Regene Roddenberry's future. That man's turned over his grave right now. We're going to get the future of that movie, Idiocracy, where people are sitting there thinking you got to freaking water your plants with Gatorade. We know, we know. We're going to get that future where if you walk up to any female nowadays and you say, and the only thing you ever say is hi. No, that, you won't even be able to say that. No, let me finish. It's a, the second you say hi, she calls sexual harassment on you right in there. That's what that's what that's what he's saying. You wouldn't even be able to say that. You do. You dare approach me like dare be like freaking JoJo Bizarre Adventure. You dare approach me. You know what? I, I honest honest to God, you know what I think is gonna happen? Please share. I, I I think that, and this is the, the scary sad truth, but you can already see it starting to happen. And I think the U.S. is destined for a second civil war. And I think by the time it's all said and done, you won't have relationships as you know it. What you'll have is, you know, at best, is if, you know, people want to have children, it'll be like flipping through a catalog. Honestly, you know, you like flip through a catalog and you'll find, uh, oh, okay, well, this is the person I choose to have a kid with. Mm. Are you, the, the Karen's civil, what the fuck? The Karen Civil War, really, Ping? Yeah. The Karen the Karens of the Karens of the world. Yeah. No, yeah. honestly, I I I think you right now there's such a fucking vacuum right now with the amount of protests and everything else that's going on, and you know it's just like it's not even so much let's change, let's have a conversation about anything. Let's look at what's wrong and how do we fix it. Let's have a conversation. Yeah, that's never going to happen, though. No, that's never going to happen. It's just chaos and destruction. It's like, oh, I don't give a shit. Let's just destroy and, and uncreate. You know what I mean? Like, this, uh. this whole thing, like, right now, it's like, okay. They're, they're going even after, like, Paw Patrol. 
because it depicted a police officer in a positive light. I'm like, this is a kid show. It's a they took the police dog. cars out of Fortnite too. So it's it's, it's an animated dog. It's a dog, for fuck's sakes. I'm like, really? I'm like, okay. But, you know, just that stupidity. And it's like, okay. Well, all right, defund the police. Abolish the police. Okay. Let's, 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 let's play, let's play that card. Let's, let's play hypotheticals here. Boom, I snap my fingers. Police are gone. Now what? Wolver Wolverine Claw Man comes out. Wolverine Claw Man comes out down down your street and says, "You know what? I'm gonna fuck your shit up." Then yeah. what? Just, Ooh, then it's gonna be robbery. There's gonna be more robbery, looting, rapes, and everything else in the world. Nowadays. No, what, but what you're gonna have is you're gonna turn into those dystopian future kind of anarchic uh, sex where it's like, "Oh well, you're part of this group, then okay, cool. You're part of that group, all right." Well, basically, somebody said this, and I do happen to agree with them. If you ever seen any movie of The Purge, there you go. Yeah. Yeah. That's what things are turning into right now. Yep. 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 I mean, it's... Dude, it's just unfortunate. I like how quick things have just deteriorated. Like, yeah, like, dude, like one minute everything's you know kind of hunky dory, everybody's kind of a okay. The only real thing people were pissed off at is Trump this, Trump that. Nah. Okay, yeah. let me let me let me piss and moan. And then AOC fucking selling her fucking communist fucking let's hug everybody cookies. <laughs> but. Once you get beyond, once you got beyond that, it was like okay, uh, there, there was really nothing. Everybody was kind of like okay, cool, you know, carrying on doing their daily. The only thing about it is everybody saying, "Cause see, that's the only thing that it, this, this kind of mess up when people say it's always all of everybody. It's either everybody or nobody. They saying like all the police are bad. I'm like, no, it's not everybody. Yeah, it's only some. Well, and that's see, and that that's the thing. It's like, okay, wait a minute. Like, you're protesting because you're saying, you know, the police are discriminating against you, which I don't doubt. By all means, don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to devalue their protest or or the the original intent. Of course. Of the movement and protest. Of course. My thing is, is like, okay, well, you don't want somebody to discriminate against you and lump you into a quote-unquote barrel and say, well, you know, you are all the same. Yet, you turn around and what is, what is the first and only thing you are doing right now? The exact same thing you are fighting against. You say you don't want discrimination. You don't want... You know, you don't want to be like, oh well, all people are this. We don't but turn yet, around. Yet, turn, but yet, but, but yet you're, you're making doing it. it. Oh, all people are this, yeah. Yeah. So it's like, okay, well, we don't look at, you know, we don't look at Muslims and say all Muslims are terrorists. We don't look at, you know, um, um, Mexicans and say, oh, well, all Mexicans are gangbangers or drug dealers or rapists or criminals. You know what I mean? So, wait a minute. So if that's the, that's if that's the truth which i mean we all realistically know it is you know what i mean then if we can't say that you know that to be the fact that oh you know one particular group this is how they are and and label them as that and that's it then why are we doing that to police like don't get me wrong there are i'm sure there's bad cops out there uh, you know there's but on the same token i'm sure there's good cops out there there's cops out there that, you know, like how many times have we seen videos where, you know, cops stop to take the time, you know, just to do something nice for somebody. I've seen you know what I mean? Or, or, or to interact with the community in, in a positive way. Not because, you know, oh, it's like a photo op, but because, you know what, cops, those cops generally give a shit. Mm -hmm. And you, you, you hear the community say, oh, well, you know what, 
thanks to officer so-and-so, you know, I, I was able to do this. Thanks to this officer, I was able to do this. Like I just seen a video <coughs> a couple days ago. A, a woman was, uh, I, I think she, she was mute. She was unable to speak or some issues. And she could only sign language at the DMV. And she was getting pissed off because she couldn't communicate because nobody at the DMV understood sign language. Which, okay, you're at a government facility, but okay, we'll go with that. Mm -hmm. uh, you can, you know, you'll have them be able to speak, you know, sp Spanish, English, and I'm sure French. But okay, we'll go with it. But not sign language. Even though you've created a language called American Sign Language, because, you know, fuck <laughs> sign language by itself. you got to have your own special one. But nobody's there to speak it. So this cop, they call the cops. Cop comes out, goes out of his way, and starts sign languaging with this lady. And finds out that, you know what, she's, she's not there to cause a problem. She's just frustrated because people don't understand her and she needs help. So not only did this cop explain what was going on to her, and, you know, obviously uh, resolve the issue with the DMV person there. She didn't even have enough to pay, I think it was like 31 bucks for whatever fee she had to pay for. I don't know if it was a license renewal fee or something like that. <clears throat> but didn't have the 31 bucks. Well, this cop reaches out of, out of his own pocket, pulls his own debit card, and pays for it. Just tells the lady, you know what, don't worry, I'll, I'll pay for it. And it's paid for. And have a nice day, ma'am. And that's it. You know. But you won't hear those stories because no, you, you don't. don't. You're not going to hear those stories. Gonna no, and that's, and that's the sad thing. You know what I mean? It's like, okay, wait a minute. Like, you know, clearly not everybody is out there being an asshole. And even in, in any community across there, I'm sure in every community there's good and bad stories about interactions with police i mean you can i'm sure come i'm sure you know the white community come out and say yeah you know what this has happened that's happened every community can but i think you know we, we definitely need to stop focusing on oh well all of them are like this no that's not the case i think it's you know a select few are, are assholes yeah we know that uh, but, you know, I would truly like to believe that the majority of them are, um, what do you call it, decent human beings that, you know, have families and, and stuff that they want to go to home, go home to every night. And I mean, one thing that people forget is the police deal with the public at its worst, never at its best. It's always, I, would, oh, I don't want to say always because that's not fair too. But I would arguably say the majority of the time, they are expected to deal with the public at its worst and put their life on the line for, honestly, some of the starting like starting pay in, in Canada for police is, you know, for an officer is, is about the, the same I could make, uh, you know, just being a maintenance worker. So, yeah, I mean, I do my nine to five, punch in, punch out. I go home. That's it. I don't got to worry about it. I don't worry about somebody killing me on a daily basis. Except because, your yeah, fellow because, co-workers because they're yeah, idiots. Yeah, because, <laughs> well, because I wanted, you know, because I, I, I pulled somebody over not to give them a ticket, but just to say, hey, your tail light's out, you know, just go and get it fixed kind of thing. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But, yeah, it's. I, I, I don't think the answer is defund the police. I think the answer is is more funding, but the key is not just blindly give them more funding. I think they just they need to spend that funding on better training. And I yes. think you make it I think you make it mandatory that they increase their training. That at least one fifth of the time that they're on the force that they go to training in de-escalation into you know uh, mental health training you know what I mean like uh, uh, you know wh whatever kind of training you know that that could potentially help them better interact with the public on a daily basis mm -hmm. I, I think that's the answer I think honestly I, I don't think it's the cops are, are bad I think they're just under trained 
like if you compare them to let's say you know uh you know a navy seal for example yeah they're not doing the same kind of thing but just on a training standpoint i mean navy seals train like they could be like a year to 18 months to train for one operation mm -hmm. where the cops honestly like what how much training do you get you they get, get police academy a thousand hours then, yeah and boom there there you go you're a cop in a thousand hours so the thousand hours is like what four months five months depending on how many hours you pop in let's say 40 hours a week 10 weeks is 400 so say 20 weeks give or take so, so let's say six months tops so mm -hmm. in six months training they're supposed to take you from joe q public into a uniformed officer and put you on the street enforcing the laws of mm -hmm. you know the particular city or state you're in uh, and you wonder why there's a problem <laughs> i mean it's you know let's uh, let's be honest here how, how are you not surprised that more shit has happened like you know like you wouldn't take a rookie pilot and you know who's who's only fly you know flown crop dusters and uh, sit up and, and, uh, hey everybody and, and, uh, yeah and the then rookie pilot uh yeah. We're and all about to crash and die. Yeah. And then sit, then sit him in front of a 767, fully loaded, and go here, go do a transatlantic flight by yourself, buddy. No, I mean it's 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 asinine. It's stupid to think that you know that that is like normal and that should be okay. So I think it, I think it just goes back to you know better training and continuous training. I think they need to institute. You know, um, you know, like at least a two-car response for every call, because what happens is, is okay, the first call that gets on the scene, okay, let's say you know what they, they get into a heated fucking debate, you know, and the and the, the, the cop or the or the guy's pissed off. Either one, doesn't matter. Either one, right? So, what should happen is the other officer should come in and kind of go. Hey, buddy, you know what? Just uh, go, go take a walk. Let me take care of this. Uh, or, you know what? Here, go give me this. Go do that. You know, something. Whatever. Just get get the other officer out of it and off the scene or, or away from it. Mm -hmm. That way you've got a fresh, cool-headed person who can see from a different perspective and kind of go, okay, well, hey, what are we dealing with here? How do we get you on your way? And how do we get back to looking for more important shit? Right, because I mean, the cops aren't there. You know, I, I would hope that the cops aren't there to be, you know, getting all crazy over a fucking parking ticket for a tail light or, or something stupid like that. You know what I mean? Like the cops are there for like, you know, murders and robberies and, you know, like heavy duty shit. Well, the thing is, there's a lot of people who become cops because they're literally like freaking Tackleberry from the police academies. They think it's all gunplay and everything, and when they go out and actually see it's not, and it's desk work and whatnot, they get frustrated, and they go, I want to shoot somebody! So when the, op oper when the opportunity arises, they don't even think. They just pull the gun, they just shoot you at 12 times. Yeah. No, and that's, that's what I mean. I think, it, like I said, I think it boils down to better training. You know, definitely better training. I mean, because, you know, another thing is, is teaching them how to deal and act in high stress situations you know what I mean because if they're dude when your adrenaline's pumping and you're you're legitimately afraid that you know you or somebody as an as an officer if you or somebody is going to get hurt dude your adrenaline starts pumping and I mean I, I don't care who you are there's not a human out there that when their adrenaline starts pumping that it doesn't put them on edge. It doesn't heighten, you know, the the fight or flight mentality of of a person. That's a natural human response. It's either are you, are you going to fight or are you going to run away? And everybody has it. So it's just better training to teach them how to handle that situation where they might be quicker on the draw on the fight side than the flight side. 
Mm-hmm. Right? And kind of go, okay, well, let's evaluate this situation. And like I said, I, at the end of the day, it all stems from better training. And the better trained the police officers are, you know what I mean? You're giving them more tools to do their job. And the more tools you give them in their tool belt, mm. you know what I mean? And the better equipped they are to, to deal with situations. Not like equipment like guns, handcuffs, you know, shit like that. But yeah. mental mental tools, mental equipment to analyze, process, and deal with situations on a daily basis. I th you're going to get that result at the end of the day that you wanted without having to abolish and defund the police you're going to get that result that people want people want police to they don't want to be afraid of the police they want the police to enforce the laws but to be fair not needlessly quickly and, and ruthlessly just you know get involved into these uh, you know crazy scenes like we've seen in uh, Minneapolis I honestly feel it's I'm, I'm conflicted to be honest with you with that whole situation in Minnesota. The reason being is two out of those four cops weren't even on the job a week. They were with their training officers and the, and the one training officer was, you know, the culprit. He's the dude that, that at the end of the day, everybody wants to fucking shank right now. Mm -hmm. But, you know, those two other guys who were, like, not even a week on the job, dude, they have no fucking clue. Like, that's why they get set up with training officers. Right? So they, they don't know. The only thing that they're, they're thinking is... Well, shit, if I, if I, like, jump in here, like, you know, what's gonna, like, is this dude gonna get pissed? Am I gonna get fired? Am I gonna fail my evaluation? Like, what, 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 you know, and you're talking, like, somebody's whole entire career in life that, I, in the blink of an eye, can be flushed down the toilet. And these poor bastards, whether they're guilty or not, I don't know. I don't know enough about the case to say yay or nay. But just from the outside looking in, these guys are on the job for not even a week, and now you know potentially they're not only is their career gone right I mean they'll be lucky if they can be a security guard at a fucking Kinko's or a quick copy or whatever fucking Starbucks even you know well the fact of the matter is their career they're... is over but their life could be over they could be sentenced to jail with, was it because every time this guy's the main guy's charge gets upped their their charge is an accessory so that means their severity of their charge also gets upped. So I'm not saying, yeah, don't throw the book at the guy. I mean, if the guy who did it, did it premeditatively and, and, and you know, if, if, it, if it comes out at the end of the day and the court uh, finds him guilty of, of all charges and, and, you know, what is being said is found to be fact and true at the end of the day, then, you know, yeah. You know, he, the punishment uh, should suit the crime. But, you know, these other guys, you know, Jesus. All right, one moment. You know? uh, I'm going to switch games because I'm not going to bore the stream with me sitting there grinding endlessly because I need to. So I'm going to switch games here. So I'll be right back. I don't know. I just... It's a shitty situation. No, I no, I fully, I 